President and Ms. Krantz, and if you will, Ms. Ryer, I think we need to lead with that. Okay. Well, we'll um, go ahead and go into that, and thank you, Floyd, Chairman, for doing that. Um, one of the things that we work through on a daily basis is not only with our existing industries, but also on the recruitment front, and what companies need to locate here in our area and our region, Valdosta Lowndes County and in the area. And what we've noticed, it's our responsibility, I think, to advise the community on what we see in um, the, you know, what we see in the data over a period of time. And what we've seen is it's broadband capability and do we have the ability to handle the um, if the transfer of information over our cur through our cu current capacity um, is the infrastructure here in the first place can it be put into place and so far especially with this one we were able to work through that with our provider um, and they're willing to step in and help us we have it on another project that we're working on from an existing industry and it, can we accommodate the capabilities that they're going to need from a broadband perspective or internet perspective and inter exchange information. And it's a concern, especially in more rural parts of our county. So um, it's up to us to make sure that we create the awareness and the importance of having that technology here in our community so that we can continue to grow. We also work with a lot of our existing industries on do you have the capacity here to operate your current and we've worked with a few of our existing industries that do not have the capacity. And operations have had to change and or move to different locations that have better connectivity. And so that's something that you know we look at and want to make sure is available here in our community. Um, 